Hello, today we're looking at a very exciting topic and that is Firefox 57. It's not out yet today, it is still the 7th or 8th of... Hello, t Hello, today we're looking, we are sneak peeking at Firefox 57. Today is the 8th of August 2017, so it's still... Currently we are only having... Firefox 54, but man, Firefox 57 looks amazing, and it's basically a whole new browser with many new features, a quicker search engine, and everything just works better, and it's a highly expected and anticipated browser release of Firefox, so we can test it out of the nightly birds. So you go to mozilla.org, Firefox channel desktop, and then you can download it. It will not install it in place of your current browser, so you can still use Firefox or Chrome or whatever, but it will not replace Firefox. It will run in its own little sandbag. So as you can see, we're busy downloading it now. And yeah. When it's finished with the download, we will have a look. I will fast forward this part to make this feature slightly quicker. See you soon. Wonderful. As we are about to be finished, we can get ready for the next step. And as you can see, it's com in the compressed package, so we will have to uncompress it. And then we open up Nightly Birds. What I found interesting in my last video, I still had my own Passes connected for Chrome and things like that, which was very interesting for me. I suspect it will be like a fresh package, but it's so that my Google password connected and everything. It's quite a surprise, but still it's not. As you can see, it's Firefox 57 Alpha A. So it's still brand new. It can't be your default browser because it's still a nightly build. It's still a long way from being reality. But man, it looks good. And you would also notice, people say this might be the new logo for Firefox 57. I'm not sure. It might just be a nightly build logo. In the past, it had like a moon or star or something like that. But now it's... So, it's not sure yet if Firefox 57 will have this new logo or something else or not. If you open up this package we just unzipped, you can go down and you can look through and you will see Firefox. And we click on it. And as you can see, that it seems like this is Firefox. No, we don't want 54. Let's close both of them. <laughs> I'm sorry for this. As you can see, we do it live. Let's try to open it up again. And this is better. As you can see, we are running now Firefox Nightly 57. And Let's search some web pages. Let's go to CNN. As you can see, first thing you can ever search in Google, Yahoo, Bing, Amazon, DuckDuckGo, Twitter, and Wikipedia. So that's quite cool that you could have different options straight out of the box. So let's go for Wikipedia. So it's a much easier to, to search for different search engines and if you go to YouTube as you can see it goes to one of my channels directly which is quite weird because we just installed it and yeah so it's actually a very quick browser so if you go to Ubuntu.com 
as you can see, it's very quick to respond Mozilla. And we go to Linux. And we say we want this to go to Linux at work. And then for fun, as you can see, there's already a few open like Linux hint. Things I looked in the past, I think, and some other apps, so it's all, it, it remember your own stuff. Which is quite scary in a sense. <laughs> but in like your system, so it, I guess it reads of the hints of the past and home of course will take you to the home screen. Refresh, we all know what the refresh means. Here you can show your bookmarks. So it's all the same stuff which we all have with here. Your side panel. And here's some cool stuff here also. So you can in sync new window, new private window, zoom, edit, library. Screenshots. I, I wanted to show you the screenshots. Basically, this is a new feature. Which is a very cool feature. As you can see, it's still beta, of course. But you can basically cut any piece. Let's say you want to send a piece of your browser to a friend. You can either save it. And then you can download it. Or you can just send this link to anybody, anywhere in the world and they will see your screenshot which is so cool and it expires in 14 days so it doesn't so it doesn't last so long or you can just download it and then yeah that's basically it it's a great new browser it's definitely worth checking it out and enjoy it. Thank you for watching. See you later. Goodbye.